And McVay, this young, handsome guy, has completely changed the way the entire NFL operates. Mm-hmm. The entire terrible coaches are getting offers just because they think they could possibly become the new offensive guru, which is what Cliff Kingsbury is being touted as, Correct. this new offensive guru. Arizona Cardinals have Josh Rosen. Who knows how people think of that? They also have the number one pick, I think. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They do. Which leads us to Kyler Murray. Yes, for $15 million. That's not. I heard that is not accurate. I heard that number was not accurate. I heard it that makes sense. I heard that conversation happened with the Oakland A's that they were talking about more money to keep him in baseball. The fifteen million number I think came out from one person and then kind of just spread like a wildfire. But I do believe he is looking for more cash. Fifteen million, maybe I don't know, but. Kyler Murray's sources came out and said, it's not $15 million. We're not looking for $15 million, but we are looking for more guaranteed cash in the $4.66 million yeah. if they would like us to stay in the baseball realm because Kyler Murray seems like a quarterback to Cliff Kingsbury could potentially turn into quite a stud there in Arizona. Yeah. Then they got Josh Rosen to potentially wheel and deal. I'm excited to see what happens in this draft all of a sudden. And I, by the way, Respect to Kyler Murray looking for more motherfucking money. Yeah. You, oh, you yeah. got all these old heads coming after him. It's business, man. You are you are worth exactly what somebody pays you. There is no overpayment. There is no underpayment. You are worth exactly what somebody's willing to pay you. That is the way it goes. And if they can if they can finagle another six million out of the Oakland A's money ball, but Billy Bean, take it. Well, there I was, love there was it. talks that like the MLB was like, hey, pay pay him as much as you need to because the Heisman Trophy winner picking baseball over football is huge, huge. for yep, the MLB. That's what I was gonna yeah. say. I love that that the MLB was feeling the heat and they sent they allegedly sent officials they, to go talk to him too. Yeah, that's huge. Because it was there's whenever they make that offer to Kyler Murray for four point six six million dollars and they draft him high mm-hmm. and they take the shot him. Kyler Murray had not played a single snap in college football yet. Kyler Murray was still the backup to Baker Mayfield. A lot has changed since the last time we discussed. Every I, I referred to Pond Stars earlier, but it's real. We are living in a new time than we were then, Kyler Murray's family is saying. We are living in a new time than we were then. Kyler Murray became a star in an offense in less than a year. Kyler Murray became a Heisman winner in less than an entire calendar year. Kyler Murray became a top five pick in less than a calendar year. Hey, MLB, we're in a whole new world now, and y'all motherfuckers sell a lot of hats. Mm -hmm. So let's go ahead and have a little bit of a discussion here about more cash. The fact that anybody's going after him for that, like those motherfuckers need to get run off the internet. Those, Those people shouldn't even be allowed on the goddamn internet. If you're him, it's whatever sport do you think you could get a second contract in. Oh, easily baseball. Yeah, but what if he can't hit? A I fucking don't know, curveball? bro. What if he can't hit you know, a curveball? Hey, you know what? <laughs> you can't hit the fucking baseball. <laughs> there was a baseball player that was drafted who threw ninety. Kid gets in the MLB, can't hit a strike. What was his name? Now he's a tight end for yeah, the Ravens. Hayden Hurst. Hayden Hurst threw ninety five or something like that. For some reason, even with a, a fucking bird box fucking blindfold on can't hit the strike zone whatever it is is it bird box mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. 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 That's yep. one. can't hit the strike zone he has a complete mental blah, blah, blah. to make it in baseball i feel now granted if i focused on baseball for a year i think i would be able to be a major league baseball player <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. i think i could play for some major league base if i got the testosterone gum that they're all fucking mm-hmm. chewing mm-hmm. and did the whole thing and actually like took batting practice i mean i saw a 91 mile an hour fastball mm-hmm. no fucking problem first i saw a 93 mile an hour slider mm-hmm. down here at the indians <laughs> fucking no problem but 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 what if he can't see it what if he can't see it there's what does he do then? It's also a much different life playing minor league baseball than it is being a first round NFL draft. Pick. Sure, I think is. he's going to be in the minors too long though. Yeah, he seems like a freak athlete. Well, yeah. the A's don't have like a super deep system. Like he seems, especially after this, if he were to go, he seems like a guy that would get fast tracked very quickly and would probably be playing for them like after the All Star. I want him in the NFL strictly for the fact that it makes the NFL draft so interesting. The MLB yeah. could have two Heisman winners in it next year. <laughs> that's something that's very interesting to think about.